fucking screw his gun. Shite. Hey, right, welcome back. Um, just another little short video as well on some basic touch ups and almost a routine maintenance, but just little touch ups on the van, what needs to now, just to make it look a bit more aesthetically pleasing, really. Look a bit better. Um, last video I did bottom strip along the front bumper, which is because it was like um, the previous one, if it's a cheap aftermarket part, the molding wasn't quite right, so it needed like a silicon bead going along the edges and that. and. Um, a little issue with that one, but it, it turned out alright in the end. Looks tired enough anyway. It's ten times better than what it was. And um, for this one, I'm just going to take the uh, Van X grill off. And um, just basically underneath it, what's happened is there's like loads of stone chips gone into it, and there's just you can see it when it's perked up in the car park. Or you look at it from distance, you think oh, it's a bit tacky that. And it's actually chipped underneath because it, was, it looks as though they painted it with like a, a black gloss. No. Bearing in mind I haven't got any black spray paint, so what I'm going to do is just rough it up and then um, paint it over with some, um, some black paint I've got. <laughs> Definitely not for plastic anyway, put it that way. But I think it's most and it'll do. And like you say, you don't see it because it's behind the grill, it's just that the white, because where it's chipped off and the white's come through, stands out quite bad. So I think like this, it'll cover it up, it'll do a good job on it. And um, see how we go from there then. Feet, so as you can see on them there. See the white, you know, gone through, yeah, close up on that. Yeah, it does look tatty, really. So, I think what I'm going to whip it off with and then um, rough it up a bit, give it a paint. Like you say, it's a Van X grill, you see it here. And I think it's got two screws here and then two more there as well. Yeah, so we'll get these with. Right, so first problem we've got to now, now I know why the previous one has not done this, the screws are rusted in there. Let's see if we can get a shot on it. You can get on it. Don't know if it's actually if you can see. Get a light and then get that in. See, and they're a bit knackered. Let's take them. You rotted to bugger. Right, plan number two. Oh, number four, can I see it? Screw extractors. Every time I do a job, it never goes simple, ever. I'll try this bad boy, see if we can out. Probably not reach. Right. Fucking screw heads gone. Shite. What's on there? Right. Black gloss. For metal, but needs must. Lockdown, got to use whatever you can, aren't you? Let's see what this shit's like. Black it is, a spades on that. Look at that. Oh, they don't dribble this everywhere. Come on, dodge your lockdown, eh, man. Can't wait till the dress is all up. Right, so that's that painted. It's been overnight now for like a bit. As you can see, a bit of a sheen on it, like not too bad, but over oh, that should, because it's quite a thick coat on that. It seems quite stiff. Over that should stop the stone chips going through the white stuff on. And then we'll um dodge it through in here and dodge it on the box. All sorts of crap in there. Managed to dig out some black screws. So we'll give them a whirl. See if they're any good. And we'll get on with it. Yeah, 
Yeah, there we have it. Front grille tidied up, painted behind it, and the uh, lower spoiler all fitted. A bit of bird splatter and shite on it, but do a job that. Definitely a lot better than what it was. Very nice one. Cheers for watching. Leave a thumbs up and uh, subscribe if you think it was alright. Cheers.